Hi guys, Lordic here as always and welcome back to another Baldur's Gate 3. Now, I've just done an hour and a half video of Raft. It's probably going to be cut down to about 40 minutes because there's some just cutting down the trees and everything so I need to speed everything up, put some music to it and yeah, but I'll do that. But it's kind of made me so I'm flagging a little bit because it is, what time is it? About 3.45am so I should have probably done this first because I... I'm doing half hour episodes on this as you know so I'm going to only get to do about an hour and then that's only going to make a couple of episodes which is probably going to go up in one day both of them so I could do about doing three four hours to set, to get ahead but uh, yeah I was going to do that but <clears throat> no I'm flagging flagging a little bit after the raft one so probably just going to do an hour and then we'll get that down I'm going to have to just get a long episode done but for now we're going to carry on with the um, adventures of Tenengar. So I shall see you in game. Okay, we're back. Now in the last episode, we just got to the Emerald Grove here. We did a fight outside the Emerald Grove where we killed some goblins. And then we got inside. We got our stuff stolen by some kids. But we got our stuff back. And then we came here and there's a girl that's been taken... Uh, in here for stealing something and they were going to get in and then he turned into a bear and so on and then they said I could uh, I could come in because they wanted to see me so let's have a look now as I've said I have played and finished early access on this game so I am going to be uh, looking at what we got here burning hands, detect thoughts yeah. <clears throat> so I am going to be um, there's going to be a lot of stuff I do know and I do know what to do and, but it's good for you just means that you'll see most of the stuff that you can do now if you have got a talk to animal spell this bear will actually talk to you and uh, it's quite funny actually the interaction he, you talk to him and he will um, I'm off with levelling up oh it's ages I was going to say, it's a, it's a shame I, I haven't got detect, I haven't talked to animals. It would be nice. But I'll leave this for now. I'll leave this interaction for now. See if I can get a talk to animals scroll. And if I can, then that would be good. And we can talk, we can kind of do this. It's quite funny. But if I don't, it doesn't matter. This is quite funny as well, this pig. So I don't want to talk to the animals if I can help it until I get a scroll of talk to animals. But if I don't get one too soon, too, if it takes, if by the time a certain part comes, then I'm just going to have to carry on. Okay, you can try and talk to these. In umbram cretus sanguine ioratus. But as you can see, they're concentrating on doing the spell. I wanted to redesign my character. Because he's a rogue with green hair, I think he stands out too much. I want to make him a little bit more subdued. Because I don't think a rogue would be this bright. So I'm thinking of uh, changing him a little bit in that respect. I don't know if you can change him. I'm going to have to try. There's a. Now, can I get this? No, will it let me have it? Okay, I can read it, but I can't take it. I'm Okay, there you go. Read that. There are little things around that you can <clears throat> that you can read, but I think uh, most of it. Oh, I could steal it. Nobody's looking. You were seen stealing. Resolving this peacefully will require more caution than you displayed in getting caught. <laughs> she had a back to me. Come on. Oh, I'll hand the stone You're book the back. At the cost of your illicit prize. But she had a back to me. I even looked to see which way everybody were facing. And you could see the red, there was nobody near me. And then as soon as I stole that, suddenly she's facing me. It does that on this game a little bit. They'll just suddenly be facing it where you're facing. It's just... Yeah. 
Anyway, let's carry on. So we're here to see Nettie. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. I've noticed it does that. It does. It's really weird at that. It's like you're 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 supposed to be able to see where everybody's looking. I'm sorry. Have you lost your senses, Cougar? Like that, you can see the red area. But then sometimes you'll steal something like here, and somebody will see it somehow. Right, let's go. Sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Rath? A thief? A poison? A threat? She is not nice. I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. I'll be honest with you. You can actually make it so that kid gets bit by the snake. <laughs> Although I'm, I might do that in the evil playthrough. I don't know. Which gets bitten by the snake. So yeah, you can make that happen. Thief, poison. What's this girl's actual crime? In prison, she's just a child. Uh, yeah, this one. Thief, poison. What's the girl? I should know. I'm a thief. You mean parasite? She eats our food, parasite. drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Teela is devil. Restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely. Do it. Calls her a devil. Okay, so we've got nature. Don't do this cherish harmony. Generally, the girl disrupts nature's balance. You can have a look like what bonuses you're going to get just by floating over the name nature. So we'll get a plus one. If I go to persuasion, I get a plus two, which is release her. I'll see that she stays out of trouble. Or you can do it, go to a detect thoughts and read Karga's mind, which I'm guessing is just going to be very. Um, crazy. Uh, so that's no good. It keeps Santa prepared to attack. Let's do persuasion. We can get a bonus, so let's get that. And let's see. Now I'm not going to save scummy if I can help it. I'm 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 not afraid of save scummy. Let me tell you this. So if somebody don't like save scummy, go and watch somebody else. Don't even complain about it. Okay. If I see any comments complaining about it, I'm just going to delete them because I don't care. Save scumming means nothing to me, okay? I do it like drinking water. It's nothing, okay? Good. So don't moan about it. But I try not to. So I'll use initiative if I have to. Uh, my uh, re-rolls if I have to. Anyway, so we've got a possible six. So we need a 12. Let's see what we can do. Now, if none of... It's possible if it gives me the full four. No, it didn't. But it's possible. You know, if if I if I fail all my uh, re rolls, then I will. Uh, I might then re, re uh, save scum. But I will try the re rolls. Could do it again if we get the right numbers. No, we didn't. <laughs> Yet again. Let's try again. I'm telling you, it's going to make me re-roll. It's, it's going to make me re-roll. It's going to make me save scum. I know it is. Or it'll give me it here. Now I've used them all up. It's possible. No, it's making me save scum. Sorry, guys. But I failed all of them. I had four goes at it. Okay, let's get this done. Like I said, if you don't like save scum in, I don't care. Do not moan, because I don't care. Right. Do it. Alright, let's try again. So, let's add the bonus. I might add a possible six bonus, but it won't give me the four. If it gave me the four, I'd have done it one of the times. Come on, give me a big number. Five. No, that's not going to make it. No matter even if it gave me the four here. Try again. That's about five fail, four, five fail, ah, twenty. That's about five or six fails in a row. Four, five fails in a row, I think. Critical success. Very well. She may go. Break your word, and my serpent shall feed. Sif, sif, deal it to me. Sif, 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 sif. Out, thief. My grace has its limits. <laughs> 
hurt. You okay, babe? Thank you, Korga. Master Halsin. Halsin isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue, lest Teela pierce it. That Teela needs a slapping. I'll tell you something, she better not come after me. If she comes after me, it's going to be hard to bite anybody with no fangs left in your face. I have to keep going. Okay. So let's go and talk to uh, Karg. In fact, let's talk to Wrath first. I have something to ask. You did well to speak up for the girl. That snake is fickle. A tragedy prevented. That snake can get its, its uh, skull crushed if it carries on. Karg seems dangerous. Well seen. Well spotted. Thank you. We've let a snake replace our leader. No, she's got a snake. Kaga seems happy to rule the roost. Who is your leader? Master Halsin. Perhaps Goblin Court. Perhaps dead. He'd set Mistress Korga back in line. Hold her to task. Stop this damned ritual. More will die if the rite is finished. So many more. Sent into a world gone mad. Well, this guy's got his head screwed on. I'm well. If no one's looking for Halcyon, I could do it. Well, let's look for Nettie ah, first. I see. You will find her deeper in the caves. Um, I could would do it. Would you? I would give anything to see Halcyon return home. No need to fret. I'll find him. Sylvanas's blessing upon you, and my gratitude as well. Halcyon is an elf with the presence of a bear. He left west with the adventurers. You won't mistake the first druid for anyone else. Okay, good, good. All right. Come, Let's Stay take this blessing you. off because we don't need it right now. No one stopped me yet. Right. Now this guy is a piece of sh. Oh, I don't like that guy. And this guy's a bit, well. s you know, a bit like you want to punch him in the face. Pain, pain. Hospitality has limits. Ah, uh, hush, Britannia. Oh, they were crushed long ago. Because they have limits. Okay, Shadow Heart wants to talk to us. Hey, you babe. That look. You're wondering why I was in pain before. Let's just clear the air about that now. Okay. It's just an old wound that hurts me from time to time. Nothing to be concerned about. It's nothing to do with the tadpoles, at least. In case your imagination is in danger of getting away from you. It's just something I have to live with. How badly does it hurt? Quite a lot, if I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. Um, I don't really... I know it's not connected to tadpoles. I mean, if you're looking at back of her hand. She ain't got a tadpole in her hand. Uh, I don't care about the artifact. She's obviously not going to tell me about that yet. She didn't trust me enough. Um, let's talk Fine. about what's happened to us. What's on your mind? Must have thought about little stowaways. Must I? Thinking about it won't help. We know what to do, so let's do it. Find a way to rid ourselves of these things. Personally, I think finding this Halsin is our best bet. I'm not too hopeful that a Gith crash will actually prove our salvation. But worth keeping in mind. Okay, I like it. That's kind of monk miles what I was thinking. What will you do if we actually manage to remove the tadpoles? I suppose we'd go our separate ways. Not a slight on your company, of course. No reason for us not to stay together if we get on well. <laughs> perhaps. Perhaps not. If we do survive, we'll have separate lives to return to. I need to get to Baldur's Gate. There's someone waiting for me there. Someone I have to reach. As soon as possible. Uh, friend? Family? Friend? A lover? Uh, it seems personal. I'm not going to pry. I think she'll appreciate it more if I don't pry. And I am trying to... She is trying, I am trying to make a waifu, so... We're, gonna, we're not going to pry. Thank you. And you're right. It's a delicate matter. See? Not something for light conversation. Uh, how am I holding up in your estimations? I must admit, you've been a surprise. Oh, thank you. Not an unpleasant one. Oh, good. Kindred spirits are few and far between for me. Besides, you saved my life aboard the Nautiloid. How can I do anything but sing your praises? Well, I would agree with that. 
Let's turn to the left, let's leave with that. So, uh, I don't remember every choice I made with her. Because, um, like I said, I uh, I played it a long time ago, this game. Uh, well, yeah, Early Access was about eight... Last time I finished Early Access about eight months ago, nine months ago. So I don't remember every choice I made, so... I won't always remember what she's going to say or what people are going to say. I don't Tiring business, like isn't it? All this travelling and adventuring. Why don't we take a little break, hmm? Allow ourselves a few moments of rest? Gives me a chance to talk to you about something, well, rather important. It's actually good, because he does that when he trusts you, so he's starting to trust. Rather important, no less. All right, go ahead. We've been on the road together for a while now, haven't well, we? Well, a little. Hmm? Survived some perils. About three episodes. Some obstacles. <laughs> Ever since you were kind enough to free me from that stone, I've seen you demonstrate remarkable guile and courage. Thank you. The way you defused the tension between Zevlor and Aradin. I was the good. The way you got Korga to release the girl. In short, I've grown to trust you. That didn't take long. You trust me already. That's very gratifying to hear. The reason I make a point of saying this is that I've grown confident enough to tell you something I've yet to tell another living soul, except for my cat. <laughs> oh, great. You see, I have this condition. Very different from the parasite we share, but just as deadly. Of course, I know this condition. I know what that is. What kind of condition? The specifics are rather personal. Okay. But suffice it to say that it is a malady I've learned to live with. And not without some effort. What it comes down to is this. Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. Your illness caused you to consume raw magic. I'm going to need the details. What kind of items are we talking about? We'll go with that one. I already know most of this. Oh, staffs, tomes, cowls. The form doesn't matter. So long as it's brimming with weave. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact. And before we were abducted. It's only a matter of time before my craving returns. That is why I turn to you. I need you. To help me find magic items to consume, it is vital. Dare I say it? Critical. Critical. Where do you suggest we find the artifacts you need? We've already done the finding. In fact, you have one in your possession. You know for yourself how hard one such an item was, and it will be no easier when even more are required to assuage my hunger. I'm gonna have to take this off because it's be bugging me. Involved, or great cost. I expect as much, don't worry. I'll be happy to help. Splendid. Bit of boldness will serve us well. <laughs> I'm sure we won't have to look very far to find what I need. Fey Rune overflows with magic infused treasure. As do our packs, as a matter of fact. We have such an item already in our possession. Primed for the moment the need arises. I hope I can count on you. So, let's see what he's on about. He's on about... Uh, where? Where, where, where? Uh, who's got it, then? Who is in... Wits and blades always sharp. Who has it? There. You know, it's got to be. One with the weave. Oh, it's got to be this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you look at the bottom of this, of this staff, it says, Gail can absorb this items magic destroying it so it basically makes it into something that's just useless basically just it's just a staff it just turned into well it's a spear actually it just turned into a spear and that's all it'll do it'll that's all it'll be worth so it won't have any magic in it no, anymore so the death's promise when the spear misses its target the will the next next attack roll against the target against true strike against true strike that'll be gone None it'll work. We just let her run off. She's but child. that's okay. I'm going to get rid of this as well, this helmet, because it's going to bug me. All it does is give him the ability to shapeshift, which you don't really need right now. But we will carry on. This guy here, I'm going to show you the, one of the most obnoxious guys in the game. It's this piece of cr person here. What will the tieflings want next? Letting the hell child go was a mistake. 
See, if you want to know what somebody looks like who I want to punch, <laughs> if you look like that, I'm sorry. Just don't act like that. The battle done. The moonrise broke the darkest one. History or myth, whatever is depicted here is long past. And my man's stupid and didn't know what to think of it. So that's progress. Can I read it? The towers seized the battle. Will let me have a go? The moon rise I've got sage. The darkest one. You recognize the mark of ah, the dark goddess Shar on the broken helmet. This army marched in her name. So many dead. Sent to the Night Singer's embrace. Moonrise must be a reference to Shah's divine sister, Saluna. There you go. So, you know, you can read another these things and get idea about the story. Got another one here. here goes nothing. Depicting another mural of things. By claw and tooth from root to thorn, the old oak's grove to wildlings sworn. The mural shows druids claiming the grove in the name of the old oak, Sylvanas, god of nature. There you go. Me being a sage when I made this character helps. So you can talk to the wolf, but it's basically really nasty and just tells you to get lost. The rats, if you've got talked to animals, will just stare at you and not talk anyway. So, yeah. Don't expect much from there. So this is just a place you can take stuff. Although there is a hidden chest in here, which we will be uh, getting soon. But first, we're going to go and see Nettie and sort this out. She's in here. Get this part done first. I see you. Just give me a moment. Okay. Anything I can do to help? A moment. This may be cat. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now. What was it you needed? I'm looking for Nettie. You found her. But I still don't know what she can do for you. Healing as soon as possible. Come here. Let's have a look at you. You seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. <laughs> Not tired, it's something in the eyes. No good way of putting this. I uh, have a tadpole in my head. A tadpole? <clears throat> a mind flare tadpole? Uh, yes. You know of them? Can you help me? I. Uh, I'll do what I can. Come. Follow me. I okay. might be able to help. Okay. We need to be quick. This way. Right. I'm. I'm. I'm this way in. Very nice. Dead drow. There's <clears throat> something in that vessel. Take a closer look. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. The Joe and I and I have the same kind of parasite. Seems so. Gave Master Halson a right start. What you do with that steak? Why did you look so suspicious? It's why he joined the adventurers on their expedition. To find out what was happening. A pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. We do. You don't have to be here for this. No, I'll stay. I'd rather know exactly what you're up to. <laughs> right. Shadow Art don't care. Let's see what we can do. Okay. Thank you. I'll take anything that can help. Of course. Now, tell me what's been happening. Any symptoms? Strange events? Uh, I can merge my mind with anyone else that's infected. Yeah. Victims can identify each other. Not that the others know they're victims, of course. How do you pick up the parasite? 
Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. On a mine flare ship, I was kidnapped and infected. A mine flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look, you've been straight with me. I have. So I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. Thank you. If you transform here, we're all dead. But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. Thank you. I appreciate this is that. This a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. Great. Nice choice. I thought you could call me, cure me. What about the bran that branch of yours? The thorn? Yes. Coated in a fatal toxin. Ooh, nasty. It was a last resort. In case I couldn't trust you. I don't have a cure. Only a way Well, that's a shame. I'm sorry for misleading you, but I had to be sure you weren't a threat before I told you everything. Now, do I have your word or not? Yes, I tutted it. I'll tut again. <sighs> I don't know. Okay, I swear. I hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Shadow Art approves, Astarian yeah. disapproves, of course. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them, trying to figure out what the hell was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. I, I, I'm about as normal as you can be. For somebody who's not normal. I am normal, for not normal. What do you mean, should be changing? Mind flayers reproduce by infecting someone with their parasite. Seven gruesome days later, the victim transforms and a new mind flayer is born. The thing in your skull, though, it's different to anything in our records. It's one of their worms, for sure. But this one gives you powers, telepathic connections, and it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Oh, don't worry, I'm nowhere near. Oh, wait. Nowhere near changing. Change, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. So you think it's only a matter of time? Could be. But there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. Don't worry, I've already told Raph I'm going to go get him. So what do you want me to do? The thing is, I've sent birds to find him. But the place is rotten with goblins. None of us can even get close. You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. I suppose so, yeah. Kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? Uh, it's a possibility. We'll go for it. All right, I'll find Halson. Thank you. It would mean everything to the Grove. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. I will keep my oath, don't worry.